Welcome back Pixels, my name is Chaos and today I'm reviewing the Snapshot 12W32A, also known as Snapshot 1.4. I don't know, it was so fast, 1.3 just came out like yesterday and oh, 1.4 Snapshot is already out. I don't know how I feel about this, it kind of like, you know, damages many servers and it pisses a lot of uh, creators off who makes mods and whatnot. But anyways, let's go on, I don't, I know I don't have a skin, I don't know, I just have to play offline because of some server problem or like the network problem. I have no clue. Well, let's get started. Uh, first off, the first block that you see right in front of me is the command block. It's 137, so you just have to write in um, slash give player 137 and you will get this block. Um, and uh, once you do have this block, uh, you can place it down and put in a command in it. So for here, I put in, um, here, I'll just do it again, slash give uh, at P. As you can see, it's written right down there. It says at P to target the nearest player. At R to target random players and at A to target all players. So you can write in at P and then write in 20 for glass. And then you can hit done. It will say command set uh, slash give P uh, to 20. And then you can right click uh, kind of uh, any kind of redstone power and it will give you that item. So like no matter how far away you are, it will just drop, drop from me. I can't really... Um, if I can pull this again, as you can see, it just dropped for me, which is pretty cool. And, uh, you know, it could be used in adventure maps and so many other things. There was another block called a work in progress block. And if you do place it down, it does give off light. Surprisingly, it does look like it has like, you know, diamond edging with glass and it is transparent. So you can see right through it. It could be used as a designer, but uh, I don't think that's the case. And holy shit, look at that. All the zombies are going ape shit trying to kill those little poor villagers that I trapped up in there but uh, anyways one cool thing about this is if you right click you will see these uh, this uh, GUI come up and uh, I'm kind of confused currently it has nothing to do uh, I tried putting in items in here oh actually yeah I, I, I tried putting in items in here nothing really happened I tried many things I couldn't really do anything so if you guys do know what to do with this let me know in the comment section below but uh, what I did see is there's two different types uh, there's primary power and secondary power the primary power is speed haste resistance jump boost and strength and for secondary power it's regeneration and uh, this is kind of cool because I feel like now enchantments might be a bit more easier uh, I, I don't know how to get EXP other than killing but if you guys want you guys can test it out and see what goes on and then let me know in the comment section below uh, but uh, as you can see there are some things that have not been added onto the real game such as jump boost Which is going to be pretty cool Maybe you'll be able to jump like four blocks high and that's something that I look forward to you can also hit cancel And you'll be out of that little area uh, Another thing that was added on is a mod that I recently did. I don't know if you guys saw it, but it was a zombie um, You know the zombie um, What was it again? Shh, damn it zombie uh, crap it's just running out of my head, but what it basically does is it turns uh, villagers into zombies as you guys can see uh, and there's two different types of zombie there's a normal zombie and then there's the villager zombie they look sexy because I know they're in pain and they're dying and I love it and the reason you see all of them turn into zombie is because they were pissing me off closing and opening the door a thousand times so I just broke the doors because I'm a bastard uh, other than the fact that's basically it so the zombies turn uh, villagers into zombies that is pretty cool um, also uh, what you can do is if you have zombies and skeletons if you do decide to spawn them they will have equipment so if I uh, spawn a ton of zombies if I if I may um, you will see some of the zombies actually do have uh, the funny faces that the testificates have if I can find one right there um, so as you can see it does have a testificate face but uh, this zombie here has a shovel which I don't know what use it has but uh, you know, uh, some of them I noticed they came with swords, so I bet they do more damage. Some of them have, uh, what do you call it, armor. I'm looking for one right now. As you can see, this is a guy with full golden armor. They also have enchantments, so as you can see, his pants are actually enchanted, surprisingly. So this might make the game a lot more harder, and I tried killing them, but it does not really drop uh, any items. So unfortunately, that is not... Uh, that is not going to help out any way whatsoever, so even if I kill them with a diamond sword or whatever, they don't drop any kind of items. And depending on the actual difficulty, they do get uh, better or stronger armor. Um, I do believe iron is the strongest right now, but it does go enchanted, so be careful about that. And uh, this also works with skeletons, so let's just spawn a ton of skeleton. And I swear to God, I okay, that skeleton has an enchanted bow. And uh, as you just saw, you know, I saw a skeleton with full armor, which is pretty cool. As you saw right there, there's a skeleton with, uh, you know, leather armor. 
This will make the game a lot harder, definitely. So, you know, it's a cool little thing. I'm sure Notch will make sure, or sorry, Jeb will make sure that it doesn't really affect uh, people who are playing on easy or normal. It may affect only people who play on harder or, you know, hardcore, which is interesting. And I would like to see that in the future. And hello there, little zombie man. You got stuck in the ground. But that's all for the snapshot. I keep forgetting I'm having brain farts too much. But that's it for the snapshot uh, 12W32A. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to leave a comment and, uh, you know, a rating. Let me know what you think about it. Do you guys think that it's uh, okay to have a snapshot so early once, uh, you know, Minecraft 1.3 just came out? I don't know. Let me know in the comment section below and I will talk to you all later. Bye bye. Alright, guys, one last thing that I forgot to mention is now vi villagers will react to how you treat them. So if you go into a new village, I tried spawning them in, uh, I was on my previous village, I spawned them in, tried to hurt them, it didn't work, but uh, if you find really like actual villagers that were spawned by the game, if you go up to them and hit them, you will see some particle effects coming up and down, which basically just means that uh, the more you hit them, uh, their actual, you know, their reply to you goes down. That's what uh, I think the thread tried to say. I can't really see it though, like right, this guy is trying to sell me six pork chops. If I hit him, uh, even if I hit him a couple times, it will still be six. Maybe it will be added on in a future time, but as you get for now, keep that in mind. There will be a new update where, you know, if you do hit villagers, they'll give you worse and worse items. One last thing that I also noticed was, uh, you know, when I was killing a zombie, or sorry, uh, a skeleton, I found these. Uh, so the golden leggings that he was wearing, and it had fire protection. Interestingly enough, it came with the actual, um, you know, the, what, what do you call this, the enchantment. I think this is a little bug where the enchantments actually drop, or it could be a rare drop, who knows. Maybe it's a rare drop that if uh, a, a mob has a lot of items, he might be able to drop one. But that's basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye. Baby, come back. You can blame it all on me. Whenever I touch the door, I get the feeling whenever I... I swear I can fly. What the fuck am I singing? Die! Ugh, give me that armor, motherfucker! Ugh. Whoa! Whoa! I think they do drop golden pants. I guess it's very rare, but uh, that that zombie just dropped golden pants. But uh, let me just kill this guy. Well, I guess they don't drop it all the time. They just drop it sometimes. But that just makes it so you know it can actually be pretty cool. But uh, uh, it could be rare. Who knows? Oh, oh no, 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 oh no, no. Ah.